people are like oh my god that is so cute where did you get that from oh my god oh my god oh my god it, it gives it girl especially with your iced coffee oh my god it's so cute hey girl hey welcome back to be sadiddy tv here on this channel we talk about anything and everything relating to beauty lifestyle and self-improvement so if that sounds like something you're interested you might as well stay around because you're gonna find out that i just became your new favorite influencer and if you're not new here hey girl welcome back so i don't know if y'all know and if you don't know you probably live under a rock but amazon prime day is coming up like today like when you guys see this it'll be day one it's july i believe 12th and 13th so i thought it would be cool to give you guys some of my amazon favorites um and kind of just you know talk about the stuff that i got of course, every item that I talk about today will be linked down below in my Amazon storefront. And we're going to get right into it. I want to keep this intro short and sweet because I have a lot of items to show you guys. Because I have a lot of Amazon favorites because I'm always shopping on Amazon. It's ridiculous. But are we all? Before COVID, but definitely after COVID. Like, come on. So let's get right into it. And actually, what I'm going to tell y'all to do, this might make the most sense, right? See, I'm going to have me on one screen. We're going to do a shared screen situation. Yeah, I'll have me on one screen, half the screen, and click my link in the bio right now. I mean, in the description right now. Open up my storefront, and as I'm talking and I'm showing y'all the items, if you see anything that you like, just go ahead and add it to the cart. Just go boop at cart, boop at cart, because we are going to get our money's worth today. Okay, so let's get right into it. Since I started off with, or since I just purchased the home, I figured let's start with house, right? So, and just so you guys know, I'm going to be looking down at my iPad because I don't want to miss anything. And then I have my Amazon on my phone to make sure that I give you guys all the proper information, okay? Okay, so for house, the first thing we have, and this is a recent purchase, I ordered a perfume holder. So, you guys have seen it before. This is nothing new. Most, you know, um, influencers have it, but it's a clear acrylic display riser shelf. And what I'll do is I'll post a video or picture of each thing that I'm posting, probably on this side, so you guys can see it and how I'm using it in my home. So this acrylic stand is perfect. It's so classy. It's elegant. It holds, I think right now I have about nine or 12 perfumes on there right now, including, I think I have like two of Robert's colognes on there as well, just because it was just there. But it holds a good amount of um, perfume. I'm going to order another one because right now, if I if I buy a perfume right now, I have no space. Period. So, love that. Um, when I redo my closet, stay tuned for that. You guys will see how I'll display it in the closet. But for right now, it's on my dresser in my bedroom. And it's fabulous. And it only cost $13.99. $13 I think I got the 9-inch. Hold on. Yes, I bought the 9-inch and I got one pack. They sell it in two and three packs. And there's a 12-inch. I wonder if that's height. Mmm. Let me see. Yeah. So they have a 12-inch that's taller. So maybe I'll buy the 12-inch so I could do like a opposite type of thing. I don't know. We'll see. Go get you. Go get you a few. Especially if you're into perfume and scents like I am. Go grab you some because it's mad cute. And it probably fits any aesthetic, honestly, because it's clear. Like, how could you go wrong with that? Next are my bookshelves. So I don't know if, you, of course, you guys can see. You've seen them in a few videos. This bookshelf here is white and gold. I purchased this on Amazon. I'm going to let you know how much it costs. So it's called the Praisin. I got the Praisin Ladder Shelf. It's, five, it's a five-tier shelf. Um, there's a few sellers that sell this. I honestly went with the cheapest seller. I'm not even going to lie. It ranged from like, I think the cheapest one I found was maybe, I think I paid like $89 or 90. Oh no, I paid $99.99. So I paid $100. They go up. Okay. There's some for a hundred. There's some for like 150. Like they go up. So I went with the cheapest and I don't even think I paid $99.99. I think I got it on a little deal. I want to say I paid $89. And I bought two, um, but they're so sleek. This is not even actually, I didn't put it in the wall yet. So it's just leaning right now. So sleek, so cute, matches my aesthetic. I'm going for the white and gold. And I think I'm going to do a, um, a hint of black. 
So, but look, fabulous. Get you, get you two, because I got me two. So I have one on both sides, and then I have a little cube situation in the middle. I love it. It fits the aesthetic. It's a go. Next, I have acrylic drawers. Okay, so let me show y'all these because these are a vibe. Okay, so these are the acrylic drawers. Um, it comes in a pack of two. I know it's a little, I can take stuff out of it so I can show you guys. And I will try to put a video on the side of how I'm using it in my bathroom. So right now they're under my bathroom sink. Um, and I have anything from like female products, feminine products, to all my other little skincare, the stuff that I don't use on a day to day, but I still use like on a weekly basis. All of that is in there. I have one for my toothpaste, my floss teeth whitening kit stuff like that like it's categorized um i'm definitely going to order more and use these under my i plan to use them under my kitchen table under the guest the guest bathroom and then robert's side in the master bathroom i'm gonna i'm gonna categorize his side too um but those were like 24 dollars i think off the top of my head they were about 24 dollars for two sets of two and they're so cute if it gets like dusty or anything, honestly, get some glass plus or some Windex, wipe it down. Again, it's clear, it's acrylic, and I like that it's a drawer, and they're stackable. You'll see in the picture or the video on the side. They're stackable, it's a drawer, it's a win-win to me, honestly. All right, next, um, doo -doo 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 -doo, my nail polish organizer. So you guys know I do nails as a business, um, and I wanted to have my nail polishes on display, especially for like my nail reels and things like that so if you're somebody that does your nails at home you give your own self manicure or pedicure and you want to have like a little display i'll put it on the side so you guys can see this rack holds so many nail polishes like i don't even remember how many it holds let me see okay it holds up to 72 polishes that's a lot of polishes so if you're a nail tech or becoming a nail tech excuse me or you do press-ons as well or whatever the case may be and you own nail polishes and get you one i would have done a wall rack i know a lot of places do wall racks but i didn't want to put holes in my wall um so that's why i went with that alternative so if you also don't want to put holes in your wall this is a great alternative it holds 72 that's a lot of polishes okay so next we have a milk frother and i'm going to show you guys right here so here is this down here is my milk frother. Um, <clears throat> it, I went with the black one and the silver stand. It comes with a stand, so I'll take it out. So here's the frother and here's the stand. It sits right on your countertop. It takes up little to no space. It is battery operated, which I personally like that. Um, I like that there's no wires, nothing. Like it's just like this. And everything on my countertop or all my appliances in general are stainless steel or some type of accent of black, you know? So this fit perfect with my kitchen aesthetic. And you can use this to make your matchas, your iced coffee, um, you know, the little whipped cream foam on top. If you into that and you're trying to be Starbucks at home and save you some money, get you a frother. It costs, let's see, $14.97. That's how much it costs right now. It's on sale right now for 32% off. So I don't know. This is the day before um, Prime Day. So I don't know if it's going to go down any further, but it was originally $21.99 and I was $14.97. Grab you one. And while we're on the topic of the frother, and I just mentioned you guys can use it for your matcha, I also purchased my matcha powder on Amazon. It's the Encha, E-N-C-H-A -E matcha powder. It's super fine great quality it's not like thick and chunky because i had to go through a few i had to go through a few matcha powders to find the one that i liked and this one it is a little expensive but matcha in general good matcha is expensive so for this pack i paid 19 dollars 90 and this is the 1.06 ounce i i love this brand and on the back it does say to use um a bamboo stick but i just use a frother and it works perfectly fine if you guys want to see a video on how i make my matcha Comment down below because I would do that. I love, once I figured it out, if you follow me on Instagram, you see me struggle with the matcha a few months ago, but I got it now. I got it. Next, 
Um, oh, next is my bar cart. So you guys seen my bar cart back in Vlogmas. I showed you guys a long time ago, so go check that out. But um, we put it together. It was easy to put together, very straight to the point. I'll put a video on the side of how I have it decorated right now. Um, but I love my bar cart. It's gold. It fits the aesthetic. It does everything it needs to do. And it's small. I didn't want a huge bar cart at the time because we were still in our apartment. So I didn't want anything too big. Um, so it's the perfect size. It has glass, um, like two glass shelves. Super cute. Surprisingly, it doesn't get dirty. Um, it's cute for a display. It's cute for the moment. It gets the job done. I paid $128 for this. And bar carts are pretty expensive, okay? So $128 to me wasn't bad at all. So I got that. And also in the video, you see that I have like a little backyard set. That was actually a gift. Um, it'll go outside at some point, but for right now, it's going inside. It's giving VIP section. It's giving, I can't hear you from the VIP. I'm going to get a rope. I swear to you. I told my friend, I said, I'm going to get a red rope. And we're going to make this corner a VIP section because in my house tour, I told you guys, I wanted that area to be like an entertainment area anyway. Granted, the seating arrangements will not stay there. That's definitely going in the backyard. But I just thought it was so cute. So for our housewarming, it's going to be a VIP section. And... Hey, if you can't get in the VIP, I don't know what to tell you, okay? Next, 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 next. Okay, next are candle accessories. You guys know I love candles. You guys know I like candles all the time. So let me just show you guys what I've got. Okay, so candle accessories. Now, forgive me, it's a little messy. I'm going to hold it up for you. But I got a, a three-in-one kind of, oh, no, sorry. It's a four-in-one candle set. So basically, you have your... Wick trimmer, your candle snuffer, your candle wick cutter, and the wick dipper. And it came in a bag and with a tray. So I'll show you guys um, this. So this is the tray. It has candle wax on it. Sorry. But again, gold. Love that. Then you have your snuffer. Do, do, do. Your snuffer. So you just put that in. You have your wick trimmer or cutter right here. And then, I don't know what, is this the snuffer cutter? Wick dipper. Oh, this is the dipper. I think this is the dipper. So you can snuff your candles out as well. You can just kind of tilt the, the wick into the wax and then the fire goes out automatically. And it comes on this nice tray. I, I wash this off like once a month, honestly. Um, and we're in the middle of the month. We're in the middle of the month. So at the end of the month, I'll wash this and then, you know, reset it. So love that. I'm actually going to purchase another one in black. So again, like I said, the accents in my office are gold. So that one stays in here. And then I'll put one outside in the living room and that one will be black. I also got this lighter from Amazon. It's like a rechargeable lighter. So I'll never have to run to the gas station to get a lighter ever again. All I have to do, it comes with a cord. You charge it. And then when it's charged, it'll be like blue. It's, it'll be lit. It's blue. It's actually dead right now. And you just put it in and it goes on the wick and then fire. The most convenient thing on the planet. And when I was looking for these um, and I had posted on my Instagram, a lot of people were saying that a lot of them are unreliable. So this one I've had for almost a year now. Works perfectly fine. Had no problems. So I would suggest to use my go on my storefront and get this exact one. Because I know a lot of people that had issues with this type of lighter in general. This one was amazing. And it's gold. Boop. All right, I have three more things. The next three things are like for the kitchen, kind of. So first we have my water bottle, which is like a clear, faded clear kind of bottle with a gold top. It is a little shabby because one, I put this in the dishwasher, so the gold on the top is gone. So just hand wash it. I didn't read the directions. It probably told me not to put it in the dishwasher, but I do what I want to do anyway. And then I like to do heat dry, so the heat probably is what messed it up. But anywho, the top is gold, and then it has markers starting from, it says fill me up, starting from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m., and then it says refill, and then it starts again at 2 p.m., all the way down 6 p.m., and then it says cheers. So it's a good way to make sure you're keeping up with your water intake. Sorry, my camera died. I've had this for so long, so the markers are starting to come off. Again, probably because I dishwashed it instead of just, you know, doing it in the sink. But um, I'm gonna get me another one so I can have two. There's a glass one that I want. I'm gonna put that in my storefront as well. 
that's on my wish list. I want to get the glass one so I can have two. I have this. Um, it's like, I think it's supposed to be like a soda can cup, kind of. It holds just under 16 ounces. Can you guys see? It's so freaking cute. I love these glasses. And then I also got these clear straws. So it came in a pack of eight. So I have four bent ones and four straight ones. And then it also came with cleaners. So when you're washing these out, there's a, like a little cleaner that you stick inside to make sure that you're getting all the germs out of the straw. Love that. And then look. Look how cute. I will say these straws are a little tall for this glass specifically, but I still use it like this. Um, but I am going to invest in some taller glasses, just like this one to match these, just a little taller. Maybe it'll go up to like right here. Um, so that's on my wish list of things to buy, possibly on Prime Day. But um, these cups, it, it gives it girl, especially with your iced coffee. Oh my God, so cute. Okay. So that's it for home. That's it for home. Let's move in to the next categories. The next categories will be pretty quick. The home was the biggest one, so I got that out the way, right? So let's get into clothes and accessories. So I'll start with accessories. So this necklace right here, it has a B on it. Um, I got this on Amazon. I used, I got it so that I could layer my chains. And I'm so surprised at how well this kept up. Again, I ordered this around the time when I moved in to my apartment. It hasn't turned, nothing. Like this chain is fab. Love this. And then I also got this bracelet. I don't know if you guys can see clearly it's supposed to be like the Cartier, but ciao. Anywho, so I got this. It's so freaking cute. I get so many compliments on this bracelet. It's not even funny. Like people are like, oh my God, that like when I line it up with my other jewelry and my watches, people are like, oh my God, that is so cute. Where did you get that from? Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. So, um... Yeah, I would have done without the rhinestones on it, though, like the big rhinestones. To me, that just gives it away that it's not real. But surprisingly, they held up. I don't know. Like, I'm super surprised. Like, super surprised. But I'm going to wear it. But who want to check me? I dare somebody to check me. I love this bracelet. So there's that. Um, so for clothes, we'll start off with this loungewear set. It's a two-piece set. I don't want to get up. But um, I'll post, maybe I'll post a video on the side of me wearing it. It's a two-piece set. It's, I think it's, lo it's loungewear, but I used it. I went to um, Pilates. I wear it around the house. I wear it outside to, like, to do errands. Like, this is definitely on my wish list. However many colors they have, I'm going to grab them because it fits so well. It snatches me so nicely. This little um, neck detail right here, fab. And cream, come on. Come on, okay? Okay. Um, what else did I get for clothes? Oh, y'all ready? Y'all not ready for this. This body shaper. Okay, so let me turn it. See, so y'all can really see. So it's a thong body shaper. So here's what it looks like. Um, and it goes up into like, it meets right where your bra would be or right under your breast. This thing right here? When I tell you suck you in, honey, the first time I tried it on, I kid you not, I was on FaceTime with my friend, and I was huffing and puffing because I, I was like, oh. But once you get in it, <sighs> snatch. Honey, if you need the secret, because oh, I just want to say, I know these girls was out here really wearing body shapers. I'm over here like, oh my God, I don't like the way my stomach looks in this dress, and Oh my God, this, and like, I know there's skims and like people wear that, but I just didn't know that people were really out here frauding. I was out here being real, y'all was frauding, F it. Now, we all frauding together because what? This thing, life changer. I'm actually gonna buy another one in nude. But um, yeah. Next, we got these heels. These open toe clear heels. Um. You know, very simple, straight to the point. I actually purchased these because I needed them for my try-on haul, my Zara try-on haul. If you did not see that, I'll link it so you can go watch it. Um, and I wore this shoe, I believe, with every single set. So that just goes to show that these can go with anything, okay? I think I wore this the entire video. It's neutral. It's straight to the point. It's high. It has the pointy toe and then the clear strap. And I thought that this was going to, like, hurt my foot. 
<laughs> grab your pair. This is a size nine. And lastly, lastly for clothes, I have on these fuzzy slippers. I don't really want to show you on my feet, but the bottom is dirty. But let's just not pay attention to that. These fluffy cream um, house slippers, love. And what I will say, because I know you guys, um, I told you guys that I got some pairs from Shein during my loungewear haul. But these are a little fluffier and they're a little softer on the sole. So I would prefer to get more of these. So I'm going to go back and see if they have any other colors. <laughs> Lastly, our techie stuff. And this is just for anybody that wants to become an influencer or is already an influencer and just wants to know, like, what are the girls buying for their videos, their techie stuff? I will let you guys know. First off, I bought a mic, like an external mic. Um, I'm using it right now, so I can't show you, but it will be linked in my storefront, of course. Um, but at least you guys can hear the quality of my video this mic is perfect i only use it for sit down videos i don't use it when i'm vlogging but anytime i'm sitting down and i'm recording a like video where i'm just stationary i use this mic love it um i have a g7x power shot 2 so i actually had to buy a like a convert a small little converter cord so that the mic can actually be plugged into my camera so i will link that as well because if you have my camera or the PowerShot 1, you're going to need that. I think the PowerShot 3, you don't need it. Don't quote me on that, but I'm almost sure for the, the third one, you don't need it. But for the 2 and the 1, you're going to need that extra piece. I think it was like 7 or $8, nothing major. I will attach that into my storefront. Next, we have my handy-dandy tripod. I love this tripod. It's like a handheld, so when I'm doing like vlogging and I just want to hold it like this, you got boom, boom, boom. And then if you want to extend it and do like a little selfie moment, you could do that. Or you can just, um, if you're like doing a video where you want to stand this up, usually I'll use this if I'm recording in my kitchen, it'll be on my island and then, or my countertop and I'll just record like so. What I love about this tripod specifically though is this of course tilts. So you can tilt it down up like if you're doing your selfie or if you're trying to capture like b-roll of something small with your hands and you want it to like angle down you can move this but also i have a light box so if i need like extra external lighting like i'll show you like boom right so you can go cool to warm and high and low it's chargeable so you can bring it with you everywhere this attaches right here hold on see look so you can attach this light box to this and then if i need extra light or whatever boom 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 okay game changer when i found this i was like oh it's freaking lit and lastly i just have these um blu-ray or blue light glasses that i use for when i'm editing because one i work from home two i'm always editing so i'm always looking at some sort of screen it came in two it came in pink and black so if i want to get funky i'll put on the pink ones and i'll just be at my desk Edit in because you're staring at the screen for so long and you don't want to damage your eyes. So I grabbed these and I have, like I said, I have a two pack. That way if I lose one, I always have another one. And her, that's that. All right, y'all. So that is it. That's all I have for you guys today for my Amazon haul or in preparation for Amazon Prime Day. Let me know down in the comments. What are y'all getting? Send me y'all wish list. Put the link to your wish list down below. Put the links of any products that you guys think I may like. Let me know because if I miss something during this Prime Day, I'm gonna be so mad. So make sure to let me know and comment what did I post, like what did I say that you guys want? Like what did y'all get from this video that y'all are definitely going to buy today and tomorrow? Let me know. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.